Hey everyone, Jason Case here with another video and today I want to talk about what works best, short or long emails. So I've read a couple of blog posts lately around this topic and both of them were talking about short form emails really work best. If you're rewinding on this data, I want to be too quick to jump to that conclusion because I think this really depends on your target audience and the type of content that you're delivering in these emails. So if you're sending off a cold email to someone, then yeah, short form email is probably going to work best because they don't know you from Adam and you need to be direct to the point. But this video, I'm going to focus more on email nurture campaigns. So it all comes down to the point of entry, how they got in your, your email funnel in the first place. So the content that you're delivering in those emails should be of equal or greater value than that content that they came into your funnel to begin with. So you got you already set the bar with that blog post or or the giveaway that you gave and delivered. So you got to you got to continue that value along the way. So short emails really aren't going to do the job there. You need to really be detailed and to the point and deliver value. The way I like to look at my emails is set them up just like let's just say you're writing a 10,000 word blog post. You're going to break that blog post down into sections. Well, think about your email campaigns, your nurture campaigns the same way. So break those down as each email be in a section and then leave that with a cliffhanger. Like, okay, well, next in my next email, I'm going to be covering this. And in my next email, I'm going to be covering this. So it's all in a sequence. It's all in a story format. So what this does is it builds anticipation to get somebody to wait for that next, next email to be coming from you. And you're delivering a lot of value. So it... It, wants, it makes them want to read that. And this takes a long form email. You can't deliver this in, in short form. So just think about this when you're, you're creating your email campaigns. I was talking to someone the other day about this and, and they said, well, don't short emails really work best? Again, it really depends on how you're sending this. But in email campaigns, I'd suggest going long. Um, and if you want, you can break these out with images too. I personally like to use it just plain text and break it out with bold and, and subject lines. It's not too long, but this way it makes it uh, seem like you just typed it up and sent it too. So keep that in mind. Anyway, that's my two cents for today's video. And um, uh, take care, guys, and see you tomorrow.